Hi everybody, this is Bob Berger over at Rustero Toyota and I just wanted to talk about multi-point inspections as you will receive one whenever you get your vehicle serviced over here. They're very important, lets you know what parts are wearing so that way you can take care of them before it gets any worse or potentially dangerous. Remember, if you want to schedule any service, call us at 262-334-9411 and I hope you enjoy the video. It is noisy because it is one of our real mechanics doing it in our actual garage. So sorry for the background noise, but we tried to get it as quiet as we could. Thank you, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Hi, my name is Jake, and I'll be showing you uh, what we look at on our multi point inspections. Beginning, we usually start in the rear back here, looking at your rear lights. Uh, as you can see, the tail lights and the license plate bulbs are illuminated. Uh, I would check the brake lights and the reverse lights and turn some of those with a mirror. Moving up to the front. Move on to filters, air filter, cabin air filter. Tested the battery, it tested out good. Check the oil level, oil level looks good. So then check your oil, and we check your cool level, which is over here. This is good. I check out your drive belt down here. So there's no uh, nothing wrong with the drive belt. Plenty of life left on it. Usually top off the washer fluid, brake fluid, is at a good level. And then just uh, an overall inspection up here to check the engine and radiator for leaks. I'm not seeing any. So after that, we move on to underneath the vehicle. Once we got your vehicle up in the air, you take your tread depth. Take my tread depth tool here. Pull the tire in three different spots take the lowest measurement. This tire is at 730 seconds. I've already checked the others, so I know that they're at seven as well. Now once we go underneath the vehicle, look at shocks, not seeing any leaks, no uh, cracks on your suspension springs. This is, okay. uh, checking the rear brakes here, there's a little window right up here that I'll look at and I can see there are about four millimeters left on these brake shoes here on the rear, which is plenty of length for rear brakes. Heat shields look secure, exhaust is secure. It looks like there are any hole developing. I don't see any rusty lines anywhere. Not seeing any leaks on the back of your engine up here. Front suspension, shocks, and stabilizer links. No leaks, not feeling the play there. Uh, I check front brakes. There's my mirror. It's right here. Take a mirror here if I'm not taking the tires off. And I can see there's about 10 millimeters left on these brake beds. Same over here. And then, okay. Pop the shield down. Okay. Up here. I don't see any leaks here either. It's nice and shiny. Axle seals, leaks. I'm not feeling play in. And let's lower it down here just a little bit and shake the front suspension down. Not feeling any play. Not feeling anything from the wheel bearing. Maybe the same on the other side. And then the last thing is check the tire pressure. So to get your to get the tire pressure, you look at the tire placard here, and it tells us to inflate the fronts to 36 psi and the rears to 33 psi.
this. And that's the multi-point inspection. And you do all this work for every oil change and service that comes through here? Every single one.